Hello, and welcome to this USA Spending Quick Start video. This video will show you how to use USA Spending to find previously awarded contracts from the federal government as part of market research for your small business. For a more detailed step-by-step -step explanation, check out our tutorial video on this topic. We'll take three steps. First, we'll identify the top industries for federal contracts to small businesses in our state. Second, we'll identify federal contracts with set-asides. Third, we'll identify potential subcontract opportunities from recent contracts. As a reminder, if you are ever unsure of the terms used on the website, you can consult the glossary located under Resources in the main menu. Let's get started! From the main menu, we'll go to Award Search and select Advanced Search. Step 1. We'll identify the top industries for federal contracts to small businesses in our state. On the Advanced Search page, scroll down to the Award Type filter and select both Contracts and Contract IDVs. Next, scroll down to the Location filter. For this example search, I'll choose the state of Mississippi as the place of performance. Next, scroll down to the Recipient Type filter and select Small Business. Now click Submit Search. Then, go to the Categories tab. Select the Industry drop-down option to see top spending by industry for contracts for work in Mississippi. Step 2. We'll identify federal contracts with set-asides. Using our existing search, scroll down to the Type of Set-Aside filter and expand all options. Select the set-asides that are applicable to your business. Once you resubmit your search, you can sort your results by the end date column by clicking the bottom arrow to see which contracts will be ending soon, which may indicate an opportunity to recompete for that contract. Step 3. We'll identify potential subcontract opportunities from recent contracts. First, remove the filters for set-asides since set-asides are for small businesses and not large businesses that are more likely to have subaward opportunities. For the same reason, remove the filter for recipient type small business. Next, I'll scroll to the Award Amount filter and enter $750,000 as the minimum amount for the award. Contracts above this amount are required by law to have a subcontracting plan. Now I'll look at the Table tab. Click on the bottom arrow in the Start Date column to sort this list based on the most recent start date for the contract. These newer contracts are more likely to have subcontract opportunities. Thank you for watching this USA Spending Quick Start video. Visit us at usaspending.gov to see federal spending transparency in action. As always, you can send us an email at usaspending.help at fiscal.treasury.gov to give feedback or ask questions about the data on the website. We look forward to hearing from you.